Channel 2 Action News, I'm Kent Evans. Our top story tonight, local police reported earlier today that the dummy involved in the hideous murders that plagued this city 25 years ago has disappeared from the police evidence storage facility late last night. Details are being withheld, but an eyewitness reports that a large man in a trench coat was seen leaving the rear door of the 13th precinct in the old market at 2 a.m. last night, carrying a suspicious package. Locals fear a repeat of that nightmare that claimed the lives of so many loved ones that fateful weekend 25 years ago. When we come back, high school football highlights and the weather. Stay with us, everybody.
and that's how it happened. Get real. That movie was so phony. Okay, so they changed a few things, but it's pretty much what happened. And Nate is going to get the real dummy tomorrow. The real dummy? Yeah, I found it online on that true crime chat room. This dude's gonna bring it to town tomorrow night. Man, you try to tell me he's gonna sell you that? Yeah, if the price is right. So why do you even want this thing? I thought your mom's friends were killed or some shit. No, it was just someone she went to high school with. But it'll be so rad. You guys know how much I love this serial killer shit? I've been researching it for years. I think it'll be awesome, babe. You two are for reeks. I'm tired. Yeah, it's getting a little late. Fun movie, though. Well, I'm gonna text you guys when I get the doll. Oh, gee, don't give me nightmares. <laughs> right. Bye, guys. Bye. See ya. So, where am I sleeping tonight? At home. I have an exam in the morning. Oh, come on. Tomorrow night. When you have the dummy, then you can stay. Alright, babe. I'll call you after I have it tomorrow. Good luck with your test. Love you. Bye.
Lillian very recently married, yes? That's right. How'd you know that? Shh. You are about to have your first anniversary together. It will be a very special occasion. Your first year together has been pleasant and pure. Your relationship is very, very strong. Will our marriage last? Don't ask such stupid questions, Laura. Of course it will last. Good. Okay. Good. Happy anniversary. Oh, thanks, man. Appreciate that. And it's not going to be our last. I can tell you that. Oh, of course right not. Have a seat. Cool. So, what's with inviting us over to this address to study your house? I'm house sitting for my sister. So, seen any good movies lately? Actually, I just rented Evil Night from the video store the other night. It was awesome! Really? Man, I have been wanting to rent Evil Night forever, but the damn thing is always checked out. So, how was the second honeymoon in Los Angeles? Oh, it was romantic, all right. We ate at restaurants every night and cuddled up and watched movies all night and had a real great time. Yeah, it was great, man. I just love the food in L.A. <laughs> Sounds like you two are really living it up. Well, we're certainly trying. Oh, yeah, I got you guys a present. Wait here. You didn't have to do that, man. I told you not to spend a lot of money on us. Trust me, it was not expensive. You guys are going to love this. Here you go. Oh man, God, this thing's pretty big. Go ahead, open it. I feel like two kids at Christmas time. Yeah. I trust it'll work this time. You can count on me, I won't let you down. Hey man, are you the guy with the doll? Who are you? I'm sorry, I thought you were somebody else. Is this what you came for? Uh, yeah. Uh, how much did you say you wanted for it? What do you got? Uh, let me see. I, I've got like 80, 90 bucks. That's not enough. What else you got? Uh, hey man, that's all I got. I, I don't have anything else. Sure you do. What do you mind? He makes these videos. Got the body for it. Hey man, I'm just here for the dummy. The best things in life aren't cheap. Yeah, well, I'm not either.
same fare another year. Are you having fun? It's hot out. I'd rather be at home in the air conditioning with you. Come on, let's go ahead and try. Better be good for five bucks. Mayor Paul, my dear. I see a long life, a very long and healthy life. You will have one, no, two beautiful children, and a very handsome husband. Must be me. Shh. You like to work, but you also like to play. See? What have I been telling you, Glenn? You're a very demanding person, and your standards are very high. You want only the best. I can see that some of your goals will come to pass. There will be some money, but I can see no more in the palm of my hand. I'm sorry. Hey, wait! We paid five dollars for this! What the hell? What a ripoff! I advise you both to go home. Hey, wait! We should get going anyway! Come on! Goddamn scam artist. I can't believe he really got it. I know, I'm super excited. So, when will Dan be home? Soon. He's covering for his boss again, on another vacation. Okay, we'll text you when you're almost here. I invited the whole gang. It's gonna be a blast. You're nuts, girl. <laughs> text me later. All right, talk to you then.
It's really him. You'd better be after what I just went through. What happened? Was it expensive? The dude wanted me to do some creepy porn shit or something in exchange for it. Are you serious? What'd you say? I just grabbed the doll and I ran. Well, you didn't pay for it? Did he see where you went? He didn't follow me. Sick bastard. I wonder how he got in the first place. I totally had a nightmare about him last night. Really? I think when everyone gets here, we should have a seance with him, like see if he comes to life. Come on, you don't think it really killed anyone, do you? Hey, I thought you believed it too. I know some of the murders really happened, but this dummy? I mean, give me a break. Well, then I guess we'll see tonight then, won't we? Oh my god, you're never gonna believe this. What? This guy got the real dummy doll. No shit. Well, I guess we're gonna have to go over there and see it, aren't we? We have to go. She's having a party. And Danny and Clint might be there. Well, can we at least smoke a bowl first? It's been a really long day. Watch your driving! I wouldn't have to go so fast if you wouldn't spend so much time with that fake-ass psychic. What's the rush? She said we could come out for after dinner anyway. We are waiting for Jenny to get off to work. Well, it's still like 40 minutes until we get to their exit. Well, since it's going to be a while, maybe you could all use a little of this. Yeah. Okay. So Alex has this entire...
entire list of just bullshit we have to do for like the next like entire weekend. And he's like, oh, I'm gonna be an asshole about it. We really ought to get it done. And I'm just like, well, okay, well, it's gonna take a while, and it's gonna suffer. It's like, oh, I'm gonna make sure that, you know, everything else is done. You gotta be on top of your game. And it's just, dude, we sell water bikes. Why are you making this way more <laughs> difficult than it has to be? So, yeah, so now we're just trying to get all this jazz done. And also, we have to, like, go out into the alleyway, and we have to pull up all the, like, weeds that are up in the gravel area where people park and like the cigarette butts and it's just like, are you serious? You have to pull up the gravel? We have to pull up the grav, not the gravel, the, the, the weeds <laughs> in the gravel oh. <laughs> and the cigarette butts in the gravel where people park and it's like, dude, this is A, the outdoors. Can't like, you sweep it? Well, we sweep the paved part, but it's just like, oh. why do we have to like maintain the gravel area that nicely when it just, like, it just doesn't matter at all? <laughs> This long sleeve shirt has been sticking in my skin all day. It's so humid. Yeah, it's gross out. I'm just gonna wear like, this shirt to the party. It's like all I'm gonna wear. I'm sure that'll be fine. Well, if they get offended, <laughs> I'll flex out. Uh, that dummy. Be like, what up, dummy? <laughs> I might get a little too drunk, but I don't know. I'm sure everyone is. Just be ready to cart me home. Tuck me in. Then we get breakfast in the morning. <coughs> Hopefully we're not dead.
Probably fighting again like usual. Ah, speak of the devil. Yeah, right. girl, let's we do it.
the real killer right here. Holy shit, that's really it. I saw a picture of it on Wikipedia. You guys, let's have a seance with it. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, you guys. Well, there's nothing to be afraid of. It won't really come to life. Well, I'm game. Me too. Yeah, come on, let's do it. The great and powerful lord of the underworld. Give this vessel your power, I beg of you. Lift the restraints and let this spirit free. Where did she find that book? Spirits of the underworld, come forth and greet us. Give this doll your powers, I beg of you. Awake! 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 God damn it. I need a cigarette. We can try again later, babe. It's probably a fake. Let's go make a drink. All right. obligated to sleep with you after a set amount of time. I know, but I want him to leave me. So he can go back to that valley slip, Becky? I don't think you have anything to worry about. All right, here goes. seem like that most of the time. Well, you're just so beautiful. I appreciate you. I desire you. Is that so wrong? Do you really mean that? Of course I do. Actually, Jenny's been gone a long time. Maybe we should go see if she is okay? Eh, I'm sure she's fine. She's probably hooking up with that cute neighbor boy. Who? <laughs> the one I caught you flirting with? Oh my god, we weren't flirting. He was just helping me shovel the driveway. Yeah, uh, with his shirt off in the middle of winter. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm gonna go check. 
check on Jenny and see if she's okay. Will you come with me, babe? Sure, babe. Hey, where'd the dummy go? Jenny! Jenny? Woo! Jenny! Hey, Jenny! Jenny! Man, where is she? Jenny! Jenny! This thing really murdered all those people, huh? Put that thing down. It freaks me out. <gasps> Holy <gasps> <gasps> ah! Oh my god, what happened to her? Uh, police. We need to call the police. Shit, my phone is dead. I think I left my inside. I don't have any service. All right, you guys go inside and call for help. I'm gonna go see if I can find a neighbor. Hurry back. What the fuck? Where'd they all go? Uh, shit, uh, uh, Danny and Clint, uh, they have a phone. They have to. Oh, shit, I totally forgot about them. Uh. <laughs> oh my God, what's happening? The dummy. You really think the dummy? <laughs> okay, so killers outside, we stay inside. We have to go get help. No, the neighbors had to have heard a scream. I bet the police are coming. Lock the door, lock the door. What about the back door? Oh, God. We gotta lock it. We'll go together, come on.
it upstairs? Look, I took track in high school. I can outrun it if I go now. Okay, okay, I have a plan. I'll distract it and you make a run for it. Time for safety and then we're done. Good job. Good job.
Thank you.